Hey everybody and welcome back to Let's Play Final Fantasy XII Part 8. I'm Anubis from Anubis Let's Plays and also from CNC Productions. Where we last took off, we had, well, entered the Garam Scythe waterway. But beforehand we actually got some sunstones and we're going to find a way to enter the Imperial Palace. So, let us traverse these cavernous waterways. Yeah, anyhow. Um... I'm going to be killing a fair few things here just to get some license points up. And the fastest way to do it, as some of you may or may not know, is to burn it with fire. So let us do that. As you can see, the rat cannot get away with me. Is there a drop anything? No, nope. just gave me experience. 89, nearly killed it. No, get back here. It's okay, just got a little ice attack for you. Gone. Ooh, drop something. Okay, so after I've killed this rat, we're going to move on. Hey, where are you going? Alright. Fire to take care of this, and... Gone. Alright, so I'm pretty sure we have to head down here. And... No, we don't. We have to head down this way. Alright, so yeah, we are going to be finding a way to get into the palace. From what I last remember, we have to head down here. No. Please go away. I'm trying to think of where I'm going. There you have a new enemy. They're like some bat creature. Like a stealing, I think that's what they're called. Head over here. Now we can kill some of them. Whoa, four against one. This is hardly fair at all. What? What? No way, that's not fair at all. See, this is really unfair. Oh, one of them disappeared. Alright. Take care of you now. Actually, wait, where are you going? Where are you going? Okay, now I'll take care of the stealing. One more hit ought to take care of this, and... Sweet. And one more hit. Well, two more hits for you, actually. It's actually a good place to level if you haven't already guessed, so, um, let's see, Ben. Yeah, you're about to level, so, kill some more guys while we're trying to get to the next area. Um, you can get that chest there, I'm pretty sure. It's the next Zodiac chest, which I was talking about before, was actually in the next area we're going to go into, which is the cellars. So, it is a good idea to not loot any chests in the cellars, just leave them. Trust me, it's not worth the gill or whatever garbage you get from there. Okay, let's burn you. Try to run away now, punk. Cool. Alright, let's head up here. While healing myself. If only I had to move haste so I could make an attack faster. Okay, you're dead. How much XP you on now? Nearly. Ah, oh, let's just run. Okay, so let's head up here. You know, I think from now on I'm probably gonna have to um grind off screen because leveling while doing the LP is going to take forever. It's gonna take so many parts. So it's not worth it. Tough to Phoenix down. Okay, going to ignore these guys. Those are fishies called Icarons, I think, or Icky something, whatever the hell their names are. They're just floating fish. That's what they are. Okay, head over here. Is there anything over there? No, there isn't. There's another fish thing, floating fish. And alright, here we are. The entrance, or the entry point to the palace. So it says, um, there's no turning back, it's now or never. Let's do it, let's do it, people. This is it, no regrets, no hesitation. CGI cutscene.
Imperial soldiers everywhere. Okay, this is the introduction of two more characters, one of them being my favorite. Or second favorite. No, I'd say favorite. This guy. Yes, those two we will find out more about later. But here we are, the Royal Palace of Rabinasta. Okay, first things first, let's get this. There you go, you got the map. That's what I was saying, how there's some urns or some treasures thing, chest thing. Yes, uh, if you save here, you might not be able to leave, so if you're in an event or something like this, it would be best that you level up, just in case you verse a boss and they are very strong, and you keep dying, because that'll be very frustrating. But anyhow, um, yes, those urns give you a map, so... Okay, so I would not even bother with getting any chests in here. Let's just roll. Okay, so here we have another cutscene. Clean up duty when the fate's over. No one's allowed upstairs. Okay. That that sucks. So let's try going upstairs and what does he do? But say, excuse me, can you please wait over there until further instructions? And then some dude's like, yeah, what's he doing? Okay, now what you have to do, of course, is talk to this guy, and he's, like, trying to go upstairs. So what else does he do? But make a diversion. Okay, so press square to call the guard or hand him when he comes, and you make around for the stairs. Okay, so... Hello? Hello? Hey, sexy, come over here. Please don't mind me. Quickly, make a runner! Run! Haha, <laughs> victorious. So now let's open the door, and the music gets louder. Now, this part's a bit of a puzzle. Um, I can't remember the exact way for it, but here we go. Pretty much we've got to find signets. And we've got to find the right signet. The signet yearns for sunstone strength to light the clouded way. Once in the palace, you'll find the signet tile. Give it to the sun's power, and it will light your path. Looks like I have a signet to find. Yes, okay, so you press square to shout. But you need to find these signet pieces. So what you want to do... You just want to go... Hey, Buckethead! Hey, Buckethead, to this guy. And then what you want to do is you want to bring him down here. So, they can follow. Hello? Hello? Hello, over there. Over here! Over here, guys, follow me. Hey, it's nice to see you too. Okay, so once they're down here, now they're out of the picture. So what we're going to do is we're going to call hey, these guys. Head. And as you can see over here, there's a signet. So what you can do is you can go, hey, let's use the crescent stone. This is the wrong one, I'm pretty sure. Yep, it's not reacting, so it's the wrong one. Okay. So let's head up here. Don't get too close to the stairs or you'll be kicked out. And head down here. So it's a lion signet. Now what's this? Oh, it reacted. And there, something will happen. Okay, so something's a lit. There's a guy there. There's nothing there. Okay, let's call Hello? the guy down here. And there you go, nothing to it. You just run down here and you should see the light. There we go. Faint light. Approach the wall. And what happens? But none other than... A door. A secret door at that. Okay, so I'm pretty sure this is a cell apart. But, um... Yes. 
If there's any treasure chests in here, which I'm pretty sure there are, do not touch any. Okay, so the door's shut on us, and now we got to find a way to get out. Or at least to find the treasure. So, it's a plain room. And there's a door. And there's a switch. Sort of gives it away when you hear the ding sound, so... And there you have it, people, we're in the treasury. That wasn't so hard now, was it? Play the leading man. Who else? Fran, the magicite. Now then, I'll take that. No, you won't. I found it. It's mine. And then when I take it from you, it'll be mine. Exit stage right. The gods do not smile on us. I like it better that way. Goddess is magicite. You're free, eh? That's quite an entrance. Impeccable timing. If I didn't know better, I'd say they were waiting all along. Stop running! End of the line. You have something that belongs to me. Damn! All this way! Fran, let's move! And well, we'll just have to stop it right there. I'm Anubis from Anubis Let's Plays, and I was from CNC Productions. You have been watching Let's Play Final Fantasy XII, Part 8. I will see you next time on Part 9. See you next time.